President Trump has had this thrown at him from the day he was elected. Yes. This is unprecedented what we're seeing in the House with the president not being able to call witnesses, not having any due process rights. Yesterday, House Democrats put out a 55-page report that, that purports to say you don't have to prove a crime, you don't have to prove a, a law was violated. They called it a scholarly report. So while the president can name his son Baron, he can't make him a Baron. This is a kangaroo court. I think what they're trying to do is impeach the president because they don't like him. There was a transcript. Remember how this started? You know, the president supposedly did something wrong in a, in a phone call. He ruined their day when he put out the transcript and he figured out, oh gosh, maybe he didn't do anything wrong. I dare say this isn't about politics at all. We're not writing the, uh, the articles of impeachment here tonight. You can see her struggling there. Her base is so strongly condemning the president that they don't need an excuse. They're going to cast as wide a net as they think they can. The substance is lacking. They know that. They know their case is weak. So they try to cover it up by denying the president procedural rights. Have they allowed the president to call his own witnesses? No. Have they allowed him to cross-examine the witnesses that were handpicked by Speaker Pelosi. No. It has been very partisan, it has been very unfair, it has been very closed, and as a consequence of that, I think the American people have perceived this to be a partisan process. More and more the rumblings in this place are Democrats went too far. Impeachment is always going to be political. It's an inherently political process, but this one feels particularly partisan. And even independent voters, like they're more comfortable with the idea of Congress and the president working together. The numbers are very strong. Get back to work. American families deserve better than this partisan paralysis. Can we not have any more questions about impeachment?